Hello. I thought I would come on here because I felt like vulnerability. I just want to show you the reality of school and bad mental health. Like, it is not for the weak people. <laughs> I feel like this is just horrible. I cannot stop crying at everything. Like, I'm so overstimulated. I've got... <laughs> I've got an exam tomorrow, I've got an exam Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then the following Monday as well. I know people probably have more, and people probably have, like, a lot more to deal with, but it's just, like, I actually, I cannot stop crying. Like, I've had a few days like this, especially since coming off sertraline. I feel like if I was on sertraline, I'd be a bit more, like, careless. One, I've been ill, but two, obviously crying makes you know it's blocked as fuck. I'm overwhelmed to max, like every little noise is annoying me, like every, just everything is annoying me and getting to me. Like I remember when I used to like put myself into a depressive state when I was like 13 and then now it's like I actually am in that state and it's like very different because obviously if you're depressed you can't really get yourself out of it, especially if you're like me where you just physically cannot get yourself out of it it is hard <laughs> you do not realize how bad it is unless you've been through it yourself and i've been getting so paranoid recently um with my ptsd it's been like i've been having like little thoughts recently like come back in my head thinking someone's gonna come back um you know when you just think of like scenarios that would never happen but they come back in your head obviously i only have six months left of school and then I can do open uni or whatever the fuck I want. But your mental health, you cannot escape it. It it really traps you. And I've got a whole paper to revise for for tomorrow morning. And obviously when you don't have good mental health, you can only take the chances where you are motivated. You cannot just spark some motivation out of nowhere. I mean, maybe some people can, but <laughs> I definitely can't. So much to do by tomorrow. And I feel like... I'm dealing with so much mentally and it's just, it's a lot. I'm doing psychology revision though, funny enough. <laughs> I'm actually still so overwhelmed and the cats are playing and I'm on the verge of crying just because they're making noise. And I think that, that is bad. <laughs> that is bad overstimulation, like what the fuck? I've been revising for about like, for about eight hours. Not like actually focusing that much, I've just been writing and writing and writing like my life fucking depends on it. And whether I cry in the middle of that haul or not, there's a good possibility I will and I'm not even is that doing like normally like no matter how bad I am, I'm like kind of numb at school, but recently like for some reason if I need to cry in school, my body just starts at crying. Like I cannot control it. It's really annoying because I'm just so overstimulated and so stressed out. I'm gonna do this exam tomorrow. And after that, I just, I don't know what I'm gonna do with myself. Like I genuinely think I will go home. I've got training tomorrow for work. This is embarrassing if anyone I know sees this. Like I've revised the whole of paper one and I've got like Tuesday, I've got to revise three papers. Three fucking papers, mate. Like, because obviously I have them all three days in a row. Um, Whereas this one I can revise for and then have a break. Whereas others I can't really do that. It's a bit shit. If you are watching this, watching me have a mental breakdown if I upload this, it's quite sad that you're watching me cry. <laughs> what better thing to do than to watch an 18 year old girl cry on a Sunday night, night before a mock. I'm not even depressed because of the mocks because I know I'm just gonna wing it. But what I am depressed about is life. <laughs> No, oh, these fucking cats are gonna get me out of spam. I wanted to. <laughs> the next time you're seeing me, this is the next day. Is it the no? It's not the next day. This is now Tuesday. I think the last time I filmed anything was Sunday, where I was. Uh, basically, I've done my first exam. So I've done psychology paper one. I've got psychology, sorry, I've got sociology tomorrow and then psychology Thursday and then law Friday. It's a long week and I also have now started working. I went for some health and safety stuff yesterday. Just a bit of like, not even my training, but just some beginning stuff. So, it's 
so it's like falling into place but in a really horrible way because <laughs> i have to get two buses to work and it's like it's in total it's like an hour and a bit of buses so yeah it feels like things are falling into place but also everything's falling apart at the same time <laughs> so i got a job but the transport awful got like exams and they're going okay but i still haven't revised for any of the other ones so wish me luck on everything so i've just completed um, my sociology exam <laughs> no no <laughs> it was a paper from like 2018 i think no um to be fair the questions weren't bad but like when it's so general i just lose it and i don't know what to talk about i just forgot everything so yeah um <laughs> one more tomorrow psychology then psychology's done and then law and sociology <laughs> they're a lot better but psychology <laughs> is gonna take some preparing and i've got work tonight so that's fun it's short and sweet because my phone's about to die but okay so it's wednesday as i said earlier i've done my second exam i have one tomorrow morning so what i'm gonna do is i've just come back from work it's currently nine and I'm walking home, I'm literally about to be home in like 10 minutes -ish. So what I'm going to do is reverse now because surprisingly I feel awake But I think that's partially because I fell asleep on the bus there <laughs> Honestly, these long days wipe me out And it's not even a long day, like it was like 3pm It was like 2, 3pm But I just get taken out by like the lightness of energy Sorry, you cannot see me but yeah, I'm going to reverse tonight Reverse tomorrow morning Hope for the best because if you if you do psychology A level, you know paper two. Whew. Nah, I mean, it's alright if you go to biology, I guess. But yeah, so I'll see you. I guess when I've done maybe one more exam, maybe even two. Fuck knows. I've got work again on Friday, so um, yeah. And then I've got my last exam on Monday. So I've done two out of five, so I'm getting somewhere. I'm nearly halfway through. Tomorrow I'll be more than halfway through. So yeah. Hello, we are now on Thursday. I do not want to out myself there. I've done my second psychology exam this morning. <laughs> no! Yeah, I can say that I pretty much hated it. It was worse than my paper one, so I'm hoping that paper one gives me some something to go off. Um, and then tomorrow I've got law. Monday I've got another sociology one, but it's only like half of a paper because we've only just learned... Um, beliefs only one sixteen marker and it was on functional recovery and oh what's the other one? plasticity so mm, it was just a bit gross um so tomorrow's paper i have faith in i have absolute faith in tomorrow's monday as well i'm pretty set i mean i don't have to revise i can, can i can wing them both if i wanted to but obviously i do want to advise i've gone through the worst of it you know like the two psychology papers I've gotten through that and that's the ones that I wanted to do well in and like struggled with and like didn't have time to revise for just all of that bollocks but <sighs> it's done now I can't go back so it's kind of like when you do GCCs you're like now it's done I, I did shit but I can't go back so it is what it is all right I'm having a babysitter she's just like doing the most random annoying things ever <laughs> no you don't if I tell her no, that she does this. <laughs> she keeps pushing me. <laughs> Push and grab. Push and grab. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Ow! She's like, she's hitting me. It's like some like cat fight. It's really funny. Yay. I've got a revise as I was saying earlier I've got a revise today but I've got a shower and then I can revise for a bit before I go to bed and then I can revise tomorrow morning so that's as far as I'm going to get for revision today um and there's nothing really else I can do because it's tomorrow so I'm still panicking though even though it's like one of my easier exams compared to the others I'm still mm, still struggling it's just got such a strict structure for everything so I kind of know Free toe picks. Go, go. But yeah, I'm not having fun. Oh. She's just barging into me. What? <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny. 
fake. You're so fake. <laughs> She's picking at her toes, the weird child. I've done another exam. Done law. Went blessing. Amazing. Amazing. Incredible. Amazing. Oh, sorry. It's really loud. But yeah, it just it went incredible and compared to the others anyway. Because um, my other ones were just obviously really stressful. But I'm so glad. Then I've just got one more Monday and it's over. Hello. So I'm gonna end this here because I feel like otherwise. It's dragged on too much and I haven't uploaded in like over a week now so I really hope you enjoyed it was very realistic it's been really hard on me so yeah I just hope that <laughs> I hope it like it made people feel like oh other people are struggling because we are all in the same boat babe um yeah thank you all for supporting me and bye